You know, I talked about this lady, talked about how woke Snow White is going to be. She's not only talking about Snow White now, she's entitled. Okay. Okay. Okay, boo. Let's, let's watch this real quick. What's she saying, man? Viral hit. If I'm gonna stand there 18 hours in a dress of an iconic Disney princess, I deserve to be paid for every hour that it is streamed online. So she's out there protesting with sat. Let's watch that again, please. If I'm gonna stand there 18 hours in a dress of an iconic Disney princess, I deserve to be paid for every hour that it is streamed online. First of all, you are getting paid already. You getting paid? You getting paid? You getting paid? You getting paid already? I don't understand what you're saying. You getting paid? She's getting paid, folks. She's getting. Anyways, you are getting paid to f act as Snow White, even if you don't look like Snow White. Like, bro, this is not Snow White. This is. This is Rachel Zelger. Zelger. All right. Just saying. Now, she's saying if she has to stand on set with the dress for 18 hours, she deserves to be paid for every hour. You know, Disney, we keep telling y'all, man, when you when you hire these walk ac actors or actresses, this is what you get. You know, I think that Disney is doomed. You know, you know what I mean? Like, because y'all don't listen. Y'all literally do not listen. You don't listen, bro. We we try to help you. Me and my peeps, we try to help you. There are YouTubers out there, they always tell you, don't go woke, bro. Tyron Magnus, you know, all of them, neurotic. They tell you, don't go woke. But y'all don't listen. Now you're in this mess. You know? I tell you, man, they've already paid her to appear as Snow White. So even if the movie should be canceled, she won. She took our money. Like, Literally, you have to stand there for 18 hours. Are you getting paid, say, $300,000? Because I think that's what they're paying her for Snow White. It's not a million dollars. $300,000. Freaking, that is somebody's salary for, hmm, let me say, six years. Okay? That is someone's salary or annual income for six years. And you are complaining, bro? You're talking about, oh. Uh, if I have to stand there with the dress, I still gotta be paid for every hour. You're not on a, you're not on a, on an hourly base, bro. It's a contract. Don't you know how this works, bro? Or you just let your agent just do everything and you just sit back in the corner. Come on, girl. Let's see. I don't hate Rachel Zegler, man. I know some of y'all just insulting, insulting her. I think she's ignorant, to be honest. She's, she's too, you know, she's part of this feminist movement and uh i think she kind of hates men too I'm, I'm i'm just because the way i see her talk is she's very very woke she's like literally a strong feminist all right hey nothing wrong with that you do you boo you hate men is it, i mean 2023 is all right to say you hate men sure why not no one cares but when you come out here thinking that you're entitled to this man now for the sag um you know um strike or whatever i'm kind of supporting it you know but again some of their demands don't make no sense because they have switched to streaming and streaming they really don't make much money okay they don't so i don't know why they're demanding oh if i was if if my uh movies on say hulu or disney i have to be paid for that i i don't think that, that i mean they don't make disney don't make money off that to be honest they don't so that don't make no sense but in other terms, like the pay and everything, I agree with that. Okay. Like y'all gotta understand, like regular actors, they don't get paid $1 million. They get paid shit, you know, very low. Okay. But this lady coming out here talking about, oh, I deserve to, like she was in Shazam that flopped so bad. I didn't even care much about a character in Shazam. She's not even a top G act. Like If it's actors like Tom Cruise or J Jackie Chan or, you know, the high-profile Will Smith, if it's those kind of actors that are talking like this, yes, people are going to listen. And, you know, they'll be like, okay, maybe, maybe, maybe something is there. But you, I'm, 
Nobody knows who you are, man. <laughs> and look at how she's putting her face with so much anger and hate. It's crazy, bro. Like, fam, chill the F out. You're getting $300,000. That's enough, man. If I get paid $300,000, I'm going to just enjoy my life with the money. Okay? I'm going to enjoy my life with the money. And she's going to get, you know, back-end bonus and whatever if the movie does well, which is a cap because it's not going to do well. Bob Iger mentioned that they might even cancel the film. If you guys don't know. So, yeah. Literally, they hired um, average dudes to replace the dwarfs. Listen, you got to give everybody opportunity, all right? Even in Aladdin, right? The, uh, what's the name? The king. I, I don't remember his name. I apologize. He was a dwarf. Why don't you guys hire a dwarf? It's an opportunity to give dwarfs, you know, work. But they hired an average person. Why are you guys changing that? I don't understand. Like, why? Snow White and the seven dwarfs, not the seven average people. Okay. How about you You get dwarves to play that shit? Give them a chance, bro. Man. And they say, I hate. They say, you know, I'm woke. Right? She's too entitled, like most women are. Most women in the West. They, most of them, they feel they're entitled. They feel like life has done them dirty and they deserve all this. No, nigga, you don't deserve nothing. You deserve sticks and stones and rubbers and sands. That's what you deserve. So... Maybe you start realizing that sooner or later. Because you're wasting your time. You think you deserve this kind of treatment. <sighs> if you guys want to watch the entire video, you can watch it from Daily Wire, you know. Uh, I don't I don't even watch what he has to say. I just know that he literally do not agree with her. If you guys know this video, give a thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Take it easy. Peace.